Slice Squad, we're going on, oh, boy. I'm talking about on, oh, on. Oh. Back again, it is your boy Snapper Jones, man. Hoodie on. Let me tell y'all, bro, I had a food allergy yesterday and my eyes are still swollen. I don't know if y'all can see that, but I look crazy as hell today. But still, y'all know they ain't gonna stop me from going to get my favorite pair of Yeezys. Oh, the Yeezys. Today is Friday, man the 16th and guess what oh damn friday the 16th anyways man today is friday the 16th and the zebra yeezys did drop today on dog now i did a how to cop video now if you seen my how to cop video and you did cop comment down below and let me know if you hit them you know what I'm saying? hey a lot of people got these man a lot of people got these i'm happy that adidas and kanye is allowing everybody to get their pair i struck out two different times bruh Two different times. But I'm back with that W. You know what I'm saying? We only take dubs around this thing. And you know your boy Sniper Jones Jones. Gonna vlog the pickup, man. So, like I said, Yeezy dropped today, which is a Friday. I'm super surprised he dropped on a Friday because usually sneakers drop Saturday. I gotta go to the mall y'all all know about Greenbrier Mall. Now, look, man, I ain't trying to get shot, stabbed, or robbed. So, y'all know how I was gonna go, man. I'm gonna be in and out. Also, I hit that Foot Locker and they hate me really recording i'm gonna say it again they hate me recording if you're new to this channel make sure you subscribe down below we're trying to hit that 10k before the end of the year also man hit that notification bell so you know when i'm dropping is heat and and really bro that's that's it man let's let's go i ain't gonna lie bro ever since my boy nick made this merch i've been wearing this hoodie damn near every day i always said if i had my own stuff i would wear it every day like if i had my own nike shoe or adidas shoe if i had my own damn k-swiss i would probably wear that shoe every single day so make sure you get the merch to drop in december if y'all want that it's gonna be very limited but other than that now we can go for real let's go all right, man, y'all already know how it is when you in a car with your boy Sniper Joan Joan. We don't just ride, bro. I don't just show B-roll of me driving, you know what I'm saying? Y'all can get that somewhere else. That's on dog. I gotta turn up. I'm going to get the pair of shoes I've been waiting for for damn near two years now. Or at least like a year and a half, but it's been long enough. Now listen, there's no way I can just go to the mall, pick up these goddamn Yeezys, and not be turned, bro. I gotta be turned. Y'all know how I'm rocking, bro. Y'all know. So what we gonna bump today? Oh, oh, yeah. I just been balling out every season. Know it's some niggas I left in the beach. I just been married to Devil Cup. I gotta pull me a four inside another leader. Time to pass and then run it up. I gotta put the new bells inside of the freezer. Back at the trap, I was ducking them people. Ducking the birds, sending out the meagles. All of my diamonds gon' bust out the meter. I'm dripping water, nigga, I will feed them. All right, so we all know that Sneakers app did their early release for the Concord 11s, man. And I actually hit on the Concord 11s. Now, I was going to do a video, but ironically, the same day the Concord 11s dropped was the same day I broke out and had them food allergies in my eye, y'all. Man, my eye was super, super swole. So I did not make a video on that, but yes, man, I did hit on the Concords early. Let me know if y'all hit on the Concords early, I want to know. Surprisingly, a lot of people hit. You know what I'm saying? I thought for a surprise drop, they'd be a little bit more limited, but I looked on my Instagram timeline and everybody got them, man. I mean, like everybody. It's gonna be a lot of Concords this year, man. So it's definitely one of those gotta have shoes, a must have shoes. You're a collector. That is like the holy grail of 11s, in my opinion. Just know your boy Snapper Joan Joan will have an early review and it's gonna be some heat, like always. But let me put this camera down because I see the option. I ain't trying to get pulled over. Finally made it out the traffic. Now we up here at the mall, bro. All right, man. I ain't gonna hold you, man. I got this. Is my shit focusing? Come on, focus. Focus on me, baby. Focus on me. All right, forget it. Focus tonight. I got this feeling, man. Y'all know that feeling like when you just don't know what's under the Christmas tree on Christmas? It's kind of the feeling I got right now, even though I know what I'm about to pick up. I just been waiting so long, and I know these are super GRs, you know what I'm saying? I know a lot of y'all not really tripping on these, but me personally, I gotta have them. So I'm hella excited, you know what I'm saying? Like, these are much cop. That's on dog. So don't be clowning me down below in the comments because I know everybody probably got them, but it don't matter. It's a grill. I'm finally about to get it. All right, so I'm going to foot Locker. Foot Locker, like I said at the crib, they always tripping on recording, so I'm gonna keep it on the low. And on top of Foot Locker be tripping, 
Security here be tripping too, so it really like a lose lose. So I really gotta be real smooth. We gonna see how smooth your boy Snapper Jones on is today. I see security right now. I'm gonna get him on the B-roll. Look. Uh huh. Look at him. Lurking, watching. I really never understood why like security always be so on vloggers whenever they're in the store. Cause in my opinion, all we doing is bringing more attention to your, your store. If I'm in your Foot Locker at Greenbrier Mall, and I'm telling people I'm at the Foot Locker at Greenbrier Mall, maybe more people will come there. They don't look at it like that, bro. They be tripping, so you know what I'm saying? All right, look, we about to go in. This, it, this is not a game. This is not, this is not a game. This is the real deal. So I'm about to tuck it and try to be smooth. Let me see if they gonna catch me. How you doing? I was coming to pick up my beef. Yeah, $20 coupon that's starting next week. Okay. You got my vlogger? Mm -hmm. Thank you. All right, y'all, I'm not even gonna hold you. That was a lot easier than last time. I think this is the reason why I be tough the other time. What's up? Huh? Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm gonna just... I'm good, I'm, I'm good, thank you though. I think the reason why I always go bad is because it's always the same dude, the manager. He know when I'm coming in, bro. Like he see me coming through the window and he automatically like start talking on his damn microphone or whatever you want to call it. And he let everybody know I'm coming. So they already be knowing your boy Joan Jones coming to pick up. Ah, cue the music. Um, this is a very, very emotional moment right now. I finally got him, man. Uh. I just want to thank everybody from the Snipe Squad, my mama. Shout out to the sidewalks for keeping me off the streets. I just want to thank every Foot Locker. Oh, Foot Locker. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. This is definitely one for the record books, fellas. I'm going to see y'all back at the crib on dog. Woo! We are back at the crib, man. How is everybody doing today, boy? Is the day your boy Snapper Jones Jones picked up one of my grills, man. Like I said in the whip. I've definitely been waiting for these for a very, 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 very long time. I'm super excited to have these in my hands. Y'all just don't understand, man. So it says on the box, Yeezy Boost, size 12. The color blocking will be white, sea black, red, and uh, yeah, that's, that's about it. Now, I haven't opened these up yet. I always wait until that moment so I can do it with y'all. And bro, we got to do this together because the game, man, we did this together ah pull them things back go in and on dog bro i'm telling y'all man finally i don't know if any of y'all out there ever had any sneaker stories but i know if it's a lot of you guys out there that's been collecting for a long time it was always that shoe let me fix this box real quick it was always that shoe that you wanted to get man or growing up that that shoe you always needed and you, you probably struck out or you had to wait a little bit later to get it. And even though, like I said, this shoe has been released twice you know, already, you know what I'm saying? A lot of people's a lot of people's grill they miss was the Space Jams. I mean, those been re-released like five, six times. So, like I said, man, this shoe to me, I don't care about the resale value. I don't care about, because I'm not selling them. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, this is my pair. This is a pair that I'm going to rock. I don't care about resale value. I don't care if these be sold for $2, resold for $2. And then like, I'm selling them anyway. I caught these to keep. So like I said, man, I'm super excited to finally have these in my collection. Y'all know that. The real question is, is the Yeezy hype dying? And I'm saying that as I got 700s on my feet and I'm here holding a 350 V2 in my hand. Me personally, I don't feel like the Yeezy hype is dying. I feel like he is making it more available for everybody. But it's tricky whenever you do stuff like that because at the end of the day, you also giving people something that they really don't want. Everybody cries when they miss out on pairs, but yet everybody wants to have them. So when you make it available, nobody wants them. It's kind of crazy, bro. It had me thinking, like, why people really in it? Like, why people really in a sneaker game? Is it to actually own sneakers that you know about and you actually care about? Or is it because, you know, it's, it's hype and it's trendy and you want to stand out and you want to be that guy that's better than this person because you have certain things. That's how I collect sneakers. I love my shoes, but at the end of the day, I'm not a materialistic person. I know that might sound like a lie coming from somebody who collects sneakers and do YouTube for a living, but it's just like, I collect sneakers for the for the love of it. Like, I love shoes. Like, I one day want to work with Champ Sports. One day I want to work with Foot Locker. I would love to work with Puma, Reebok, Adidas, Nike, any of those companies that actually make my own shoe or help them push 
different colorways or just different types of silhouettes that they have. That's the love that I have for the sneaker game. Everybody has their own reason, right? Everybody has their own definition or, or their own reason why they got into it. That's just personally mine. So when I see shoes like these, man, it just means more to me than just a regular pickup. And here we have it, bro. Y'all know that I like to break down my videos. I will be doing a full review and uh, full on foot as soon as tomorrow. So tomorrow I will be doing an on foot on these. So make sure you subscribe to my channel if you're new for that. Also, man, let me know how y'all feel about the zebras. Were you able to cop? Even though these were actually a lot of them out there because it was really a lot of them out there. I've still seen people on my Instagram striking out. If you already don't follow me on Instagram, I will link that down below, man. Follow me on IG where I do giveaways on my daily stories and I also just put out pics that y'all gonna love. Also, hit the notification bell if you already haven't. Stay tuned, man. I got new videos coming out on these ASAP. Man, I finally got them. Man, I finally got them. After all these years. It's your boy Snapper Jones Jones. I'll catch y'all next time. Gang, gang. Yeah.